Welcome back to Hello Experts Explorers. Today we are diving into the heart of Mumbai's urban marvels with an exciting journey across the Mumbai Trans Harbour Link. Buckle up as we unravel the story behind this groundbreaking infrastructure project that is reshaping the city's skyline. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join us on this incredible adventure through Mumbai's modern marvels. The ongoing construction of Mumbai Trans Harbour Link, also recognized as the Sabri Nava Sheva Trans Harbour Link and officially named the Shiri Atal Bihari Vajpayee Trans Harbour Link, entails the development of a 21.8 km 6 lane elevated road bridge. This transformative infrastructure project aims to seamlessly connect Mumbai's to its satellite city, Navi Mumbai. Upon completion, it is supposed to claim the title of India's longest sea bridge and secure the 12th spot among the world's longest sea bridges. The journey of the bridge will commence in Savary South Mumbai, traversing Ten Creek just north of the Alipenta Island and concluding its path at Chiril near Navasheva in Oran Taluka. Strategically linked to the Mumbai Pune Expressway in the east and under construction coastal road in the west, the six-lane highway boosts a width of 27 meters. Additionally, it incorporates two emergency exit lanes, an edge strip and a crash barrier. The ambitious project is estimated to incur a total cost of 2.2 billion US dollar. According to the Mumbai Metropolitan Region Development Authority, once operational, the bridge is anticipated to witness a daily traffic influx of approximately 70,000 vehicles, making it a pivotal artery for the region's transportation network. The MMRDA has installed noise and vision barriers along a 6km stretch of Mumbai Trans Harbour Link. Vision barriers strategically block the view of the Bhabha Atomic Research Center, while noise barriers protect flamingos and migratory birds in the Savory mud flats. To ensure tranquility, the MMRDA designates almost 2 km of the Savory side of MTHL as a silent zone, extending similar measures to sensitive areas of the Navi Mumbai side. Construction equipment is fitted with silencers to reduce noise impact on migratory birds. The project employs reverse circulation drilling for quieter and faster construction in marine environments. The Mumbai Trans Harbour is a significant infrastructure project in India connecting Mumbai and Navi Mumbai. Here are some of the key facts about this project. The MTHL is India's longest sea bridge spanning 16.5 kilometers over the Thane Creek and 5.5 kilometers on land total 21.8 kilometers inland. The project is estimated to cost $2.2 billion. MMRD estimates that the 70,000 vehicles will use the bridge daily after its completion. The speed limit on the bridge will be 100 km per hour. The toll for one-way trip on the MTHL will be 250 Indian rupees, scheduled to be inaugurated on Jan 12, 2024. The construction of the MTHL began in earliest in 2018 with the help of a 5.6 km long temporary access bridge built to transport equipment and workers. A sum of 330 crore Indian rupees was set aside for the environment management plan which includes the plantation of mangroves, relocation of trees, air pollution monitoring, water pollution monitoring and monitoring of the flamingos for 10 years. The MMRDA formulated a fisherman compensation policy, a first of its kind in India, to compensate existing fishermen and families affected by the construction of MTHL. The MTHL is expected to reduce travel time between Mumbai Mumbai and Navi Mumbai by a significant amount, helping to alleviate traffic conditions in the island city. A portion of the funds allocated for the environmental impact reduction will be used for the construction of the country's first solar-powered marine mammal museum in Navi Mumbai, which will house skeletal remains of the endangered marine species. That's all for today. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.